This is part of my exercise for hypnotherapy, and I want you to be able to use this to improve your outlook and your mood and to bring yourself up anytime you need to. And you can listen to this over and over. <clears throat> and uh, I'm going to have you do things like stand up and change positions just a little bit because part of your um, position, your attitude, your the way you're holding your body uh, sometimes has a lot to do with the way you feel, the way your mind feels. So we're going to do this uh, standing up. So just take a minute and put your things on the floor or to the side on a table or something. So you can step forward one step and step back. Uh, now you're going to be able to step forward and you'll be able to step back. So, it, so go ahead and get into the position to just stand up for me right now. So go ahead and stand up for me. Just stand up right in front of your chair. And make sure you've got a little bit of room. Okay, are you good? Okay, and so here's what we're going to do. Go ahead and just relax your arms and hands. Put them down by your sides with your arms straight. I want you to visualize and imagine that there's a circle. It's on the floor right in front of you. You can make it as big as you could possibly want. Or small. I want you to just notice that. Notice the circle. I want you to just think what color it would be. I want you to think what it would sound like if there was a sound to it. What it would smell like if there was a scent to it. If there's a feeling to it. Now let's have this be your circle of excellence. Where you are functioning in a state of excellence where you are congruent with yourself. Mind, body, and emotions. And then I want you to just stand up for me, if you haven't already, and close your eyes. Stand up and close your eyes. Just close your eyes. Relax your arms and hands. And I want you to think back to any time in your life when you felt like you were in the state of excellence. When you had the confidence and you had the self-esteem. Maybe it was today. Maybe it was yesterday. Maybe it was when you were 10 years old or when you were 21 years old. But you had really positive beliefs. You had good resources. You were in a state of excellence. Things looked good, felt good, sounded really, really good. And I want you to breathe that in. And I want you to notice your body language as well. When you're in this state of excellence, what's going on with the spine? Are the shoulders back? Where is your head? Where are the arms and hands? Be aware of your energy as your energy expands around you, your entire body, and just being in this state of excellence. And what I want you to do, you can do it with eyes open or closed. Take this energy and just take a little baby step and just step into your circle of excellence. Eyes open or closed, just step into your circle. And if you've opened your eyes, now close them. And imagine that circle of excellence just surrounding you totally and completely. You can feel it. Maybe you open your palms up or maybe you kind of press them down. You feel the energy of it. You can visualize and imagine the state of excellence just going from the feet all the way up into the legs, into the hips, into the body, the chest, into the shoulders and the arms, and the hands and the fingertips. The state of excellence is going all the way through the spine into the neck, all the way up into the facial muscles through the top of the head, then out from the top of the head all the way up into the center of the universe. The state of excellence.
Now, now that you are a success today, and any time you step into this circle of excellence, it's going to trigger a really positive resource state that you know that you have. You have this state. You know that you have tools. You know that you have confidence. You do have self-esteem. You're able to communicate effectively and find out information. So just allow that state to be there, however you decide it to be. Breathe it in for me. Breathe. Good. Now exhale slowly and then open your eyes. I want you to just take a little step back out of your circle. Just step out of your circle for a moment because this is now going to be an anchor for you. And this is what I want you to do. I want you to go ahead and close your eyes and release and let go of that circle of excellence. Just let it go. And now I want you to think of situations that have been in the past that could have been difficult for you. People, places, or events that you were maybe having challenges that you were having struggles with. And notice the physiology, how it changed in the body. Notice the thoughts in your mind, what has shifted, what's going on, on an emotional level. So just think of a situation, person, place, or an event that affected you in a challenging or perhaps a negative way. And when you have that, just nod your head yes. Go ahead and actually nod your head yes. And just know that that is in the past. And that old behavior, those old thoughts and those old feelings no longer need to have the ability to control and affect you because now you have a state of excellence that you can step into. So when you're ready, eyes open or closed, go ahead and take that step forward and step into your circle of excellence and change your physiology around now. Do it consciously. Now breathe in. Allow the physical, mental, emotional, and spiritual state of excellence to come to you. Get back into that level of confidence. Get back into that level of success because your mind unconsciously has all the resources that you need. And any time you're struggling or having challenges, you can step out of that state. And in this state, with your eyes closed, just look up to your forehead, just look up through your eyelids. When your eyes go up, you're in a visual mode or state. Because when you look up, your eyes are accessing your visual cortex. Good. Now bring them back to normal. Open your eyes. Step back out of your circle of excellence and just shake it out for me a little bit. Shake your arms and hands. Shake them out. We'll do it again a couple of more times. Okay? So close your eyes or keep them open, whatever feels safe and easy for you. Think of another challenging time or situation. Maybe it's right now or maybe it's in the past and it's still affecting you. Shift your physiology. Notice what's going on inside. Is it a person? Is it a place? An event? Just notice what happens. Don't keep it for too long and when you're ready, step into your circle of excellence and shift out of it. Immediately shift out of it. Change your physiology, your body. Breathe. Change your psychology, your mindset. Let's anchor this state. Hey, maybe you want to have a key word with it. Maybe you want to do something with your hand or hands. Maybe put your fingers together. Maybe open your palms. Maybe hold them downwards. Maybe take a couple of deep breaths so you can recognize the circle of excellence. 
Anytime you step into the circle, it changes your physiology. It changes your psychology. Good. Hold on to it. Look up. Smile. Keep your eyes closed, but look up. Good. Bring your eyes back forward and down. Now open your eyes and step back out of the circle. Shake it out again. I'm going to have you do it on your own this time. Shake it out. So just think. People, places, events, or situations, now or in the past, that are affecting you. You want to shift your physiology. The second it comes up, this is called anchoring as well, the second it comes up and you recognize it in the physiology, get out of it. Step into your circle. Shift your state. What do you need to do? Shift your state. Breathe. Let it go. Breathe. And just remember, you're always moving forward. You're always walking forward. You're always stepping forward. Step into this behavioral flexibility. Know your outcome. Have good sensory, sensory acuity. Get into the state of excellence right now. Smile. Smile. Keep your eyes closed and look up. Good. All right. Now open your eyes. Stay where you are. Turn. And just acknowledge your surroundings. Be aware that you are in the state of excellence. Notice your physiology. Good. Tell yourself, good job. Good job. To shift out of depression, look upward and smile.